Hi there, Darren from Darren T Fitness here. Thanks for tuning in. Um, so, are you, do you feel like you're stuck in a rut in your job or at your or in life? Um, you have to have a fit mind to, you know, to, if you want to stay fit and to stay in shape and everything. So, you know, if, if you're if you're stuck in a rut, um, you know, you might be getting into the negative thinking and and just you know, kind of getting the I don't care attitude and just not taking the time to work out or exercise or do things that are really good for you and healthy for you. Um, so, you know, being if you're stuck in a, a rut with your job or whatever, you know, it can be, it can, it can you know, go against your health and all that kind of stuff, cause health problems and, and everything. So you want to make sure you keep building your personal development, you know, read some books, um, you know, try to stay around positive people, things like that. Because, um, you know, if we're, when, we're, when we're in a job or something, you know, we're, we're pretty much at somebody else's will, you know, we're, kind of work for somebody else so we have to abide by their rules and everything which is cool um that's the way it is but you know we have to get permission to leave because you, know, you got a job to do so you got to do that first and that kind of takes priority over a lot of other things personal stuff um but you know so it's like if you know if you get sick or your kids get sick or something you know you got to take them to the doctor or something or you have to go to the doctor you know that usually goes against your own sick time or personal time that you have to take off um, so you don't really get to use that time, you know, for you to do something fun, um, you know, because you, you know, you have to use it for other, you know, for other things. So, you know, really, you don't do you get a vacation. <laughs> you have to ask yourself that. Um, but you know, you can't, you know, if your kids are sick or even if you have pets or something. Um, like I just had to take my dog to the uh, vet the other day just because he, you know, because he was sick and. Uh, you know, I had to take time off from work to do that in the morning, and then I, you know, go get him later in the day. I had to take time off again to, to go pick him up, and you know, of course, that goes against me. It goes against my personal vacation time, which that's no fun. You know, you don't want to, you want to spend time with them, but you don't want to spend it, you know, going your vacation time going to a doctor or something like that. Um, but it seems just kind of seems like a lot of people just don't, you know, don't take a chance on better in themselves or they get they just kind of get complacent and in this kind of in that rut and they just kind of go along with the flow and they don't really raise rise to their full potential and that's what I'm hoping that you will do um that's what I'm trying to do um because you know you don't want to get stuck you know you want to you know you want to be able to live your own life and you know build your dreams and you'll know, do some things you might have a bucket list or something you want to do you know um but you know you don't because you know you want to you know try to find a better job or maybe there is a better job out there for you you know that you can find you know just kind of educate yourself and you'll know, get knowledge about knowledgeable about something that you really like something that you would get paid or that you would rather or you would do even if you didn't get paid for it um you know so but a lot of people just kind of get in that comfort zone and they don't they don't do anything um but you know that's something that it's hard to break out of that especially if you're a real shy person with social anxiety like i have um like i suffer from, i suffer from it i have that i'm extremely shy and get socially anxious and stuff like that around people and and things you know you, um, and I ramble on in videos <laughs> but um you know it's stuff that I work on trying to get trying to get better at um, so you know if you know if I can do it I know you can do it too because um, I know there's a lot of books out there on self-confidence or social anxiety and shyness how to overcome it um, and, I, and I know I've personally seen some people that have overcome you know being extremely introverted or being really shy and you know real busy with life and everything and that they've you know, gone on and improved themselves and you know become very successful people so I know it's possible to do um, so you just kind of have to get out there and you know stay away from the negative Nellies and Neds and all that um, you don't want to get around those those people kind of try to keep you down um, to their level because they're they're afraid to, that you'll succeed and you'll leave them in life or whatever and you know they're so they're kind of trying to pull you down and destroy your dreams even you know so you kind of have to try to not to listen to those kind of people um, that can be hard to do. Uh, trust me, I know on that. Um, but you know, you, so you just kind of find you know find some people that are positive and supportive of you, and they'll help you out, and you know, kind of that'll kind of help you. And like I said, if you can get some kind of a personal development book, you know, like Extreme Ownership, or you know, there's the Slight Edge. Um, I know there's a few other ones too out there. There's quite a bunch of them out there that you can um, get and read. Or you can get an audio book and listen to it on your way to work every day um, and just kind of help you stay positive, stay focused and, you know, plan out your goals, your dreams, what you want to do and then go for it. Is uh, You can do it. And, you know, if, if you've got any questions, um, go ahead and, you know, 
leave a comment or you know let me know reach out and let me know um, I'd be glad to help um, if you got you know if you got any questions or whatever um, or any or any tips or anything you want to share um, go ahead and do that um, and uh, thanks again for tuning in and um, we'll see you on the next video